Hello everybody, welcome to Daggerfell. Um, we're running Daggerfell Unity here, which is a part of Daggerfell onto Unity. So we're going to give it a whirl, see how it works. We're going to do a warrior to start off with. Apparently it's a very hard game to play, very unforgiving. Uh, right, warriors are those heavily trained in the arts of warfare. The adapt to use of many weapons. Yeah, okay. Can I do that. Hmm. Okay. Use my face. <laughs> Right, now we're going to roll our stats. Now, I haven't played Daggerfall before, so I'm expecting to die many hundreds of times. Uh, it's not too bad, that. No, I want to pass it bonus to hit. This way, I don't really know what's good, but that looks good. We get that up to 60, nothing below 50. Add the rest to strength, uh, agility, speed. I think that looks good. I mean, plus three damage. All right, so okay, that. Now, my favour blade a little bit. Archery most, 36 for short blade. I guess that's why we favour the under, the underworld is partly favouring thing because it's like we're good with daggers. Right, okay then, climbing, medical. Probably gonna be important, swimming. Jumping and dodging. Okay, right. Believe that as it is. Apparently, it can affect how quickly you level up if you make it too easy for yourself. Let's have a look at this. 400 years after Tiber Septim's reign, the beginning will meet the end, and the bloody circle will close in the Empire of Cambriel. The unworthy heirs of the Septim dynasty have allowed the bonds of the Empire to weaken and crack. Uriel Septim, the seventh, cannot repair what his ancestors ignored. The provinces fight among themselves like neglected children, drunk with rebellion, and one indomitable power hides itself, but not forever. darker still. Over a year ago, King Lysandus of Daggerfall died honorably on the field of battle. He was as loyal a subject, ally, and friend as you are. I did grieve for him, but his spirit does not rest. With a spectral army, he haunts his former kingdom, crying for revenge. I do not know why a good and loyal man would be so cursed. Perhaps you can find the answer and close the marble jaws of oblivion, bringing peace to his soul. I've heard that before. I ask this as your emperor. I have one lesser request. 
Several years ago, I wrote a letter to the Queen of Daggerfall. It never arrived. The letter was of a sentimental and personal nature. If you find and destroy that letter, I will be grateful. Now, my champion, rest well this night, for tomorrow you sail for the kingdom of Daggerfall. Hmm. That would have been the court mage with him. Can't remember whose court mage it was. Pretty sure it was High Elf. Right. Yes, we'll use that. This has been changed by Unity. I did try the DOS version and uh, yeah, yeah. Won't the silky smooth as this. Right. F6. You have done a bit of a uh, short sword. I'm really good with a short sword. Or short blade. Seven damage. I think we'll try the short thing first. We'll equip it with a Z. There we go. I've got um, hold to attack selected as well rather than the banana. Which means it does that automatically instead of me having to waggle back and forth like that. And we're going to save it because everything I've read about this game says I'm going to die horribly several times every five minutes. Yes, I've done that. That pops up, by the way. After a few minutes, just keeps. I don't think it's actually linked to anything other than the timer. Right. So we've got to wait. It will eventually let us out. There we go. Yes. Let me out yet? There we go, oh, right mouse button, right, it should be a mouse one, this one. Done this bit before. Look at the out wheels, he's dead. He nearly killed him. There we go, I killed the mouse. I mean the rat, I mean whatever he is. Then. Oh, that was. I've done this area here before, but I lost so much health trying to figure out how to attack. I had to start again. So, um, two. Left two. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm assuming that's what you do. I mean, it's a bit out of sync. You can swap weapon hands as well with H, which is quite good. Right, okay. They recommend saving every five minutes on this game because apparently you die easily. And the dungeons are supposed to be epic. I mean, randomly generated, apparently. I'm an old RPG, I behold uh, Black Crypts, that kind of thing from the 80s. I used to just. Aha. Um, is it two? Let's 
So yeah. Oops, what's this? Ineffective. It's not good, is it? So what is effective? Okay, I've got a lot of ineffective weapons. How do I grab that? Can I grab that? Can't do anything about him, he's nearly killed me. Okay. Reload. Let's not open that door then. changes to the controls. Right, crouch is C. Slide. You've got S used. Yes, reverse. Slide then, slide. Halt. Halt is sneak. Oh god, just set to the halts. I've noticed I'm getting random weapons when I start this game as well, so you're never going to get the same gear twice. Stand up then, stand up. Say attacking. Right, oh, set to default on it. Right mouse button. Aha. Okay then, let's get some armor on. What is that? So curious. I think we'll keep that one. No, oh, I just don't. All oh, right, I've swapped it for that. Anyway. Okay. Right, you just I've no idea how you were uh, 
They've got what rest and stuff yet. Okay, now we uh, got that sorted. What's the key for resting then? Cast spell, recast. Rest is out. Uh, but before we rest, let's save it. And of course, it's Lenin, isn't it? Right. Yeah, that was easy to go and work with. We're past that. I've only really got a little bit of help for I'm sneaking. Moving so slow. He's to play these kind of games all the time, but they move forward. Oops, there we go. That's all we need. just in case we're attacked because it will probably randomly generate an attack on us. So rest until fully healed. There we go. We can hit me, can't he? Bloody hell. Right mouse button. Walking sweet, you know, left. That's nah, left. Right, okay then, let's grab everything. What have we got? F6, right. Plus 3. Plus 7. Plus 9. So put some of that on. That's plus 3. That's plus 3. Okay, that's good. Oh, we'll get in there. And these are levers. Across the air. Right, so. Yeah, at least uh, on the old days, you used to move forward like that. One square. Imagine that's a square. You'd go from there to there, from there to there, from there to there. Turn from there to there, from there to there, from there to there, turn, attack, attack, like that. They're all in 3D like this. But when they when they made it first person, when it actually started to move like this, uh, I think Doom, not Doom, um, it was ID, ID Soft did it first. It lost something. Really. 
next room. What the hell is that? Excuse me, bear. Jesus. Obvious result, wasn't it? Newbie versus the grizzly bear. Let's try it again. I'll just swap. Early weapon switch hands. Yet, bear. Bad doing in a, in a dungeon. Seriously, it's a stupid place for a bear. Ready weapon. Oh, ready weapon. Ready the weapon. That's it. Yes, F6, can I swap hands, what's the swap hands for? So switch hands is it, there we go, this should be a much greater reach. Thank 
close to my limit, eh? Yeah, loot wise. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Right, let's go to this. Right. We've got a lot of graves. Don't know you use that yet. Oh, an axe. What's the axe? We'll give it a try. We'll try it. Steel plus six. No, it's plus nine, and that is plus seven. Let's take that off. Oh, I want to keep some stuff. Broad shield, sword, sword. I think that's going to be better than the uh, short sword. Silver, I, I remember now, silver. I've got a feeling that in order to kill um, certain creatures we're going to need silver. Just see if we can. Uh, there it is. Get rid of the leather greaves, get rid of the leather pauldron. Chain pants on. No, I'm not doing it on me. That's great, that's great. Yeah, right. set now. Not very good with the axe yet. Look 
trying to do is find our way out of this. This is the dungeon so far. We are going in the right direction. At least we are when we're going this way. Going up. Bit better with the armor on. Silver seems to have done the trick. So magical creatures we need silver. Oops, no, no, no. Well, we learned fast. There used to be silver in oblivion. Got that look at this. Someone in circle, isn't it? Definitely a someone in circle. Which used to also be a thing. I think we're back in that same room. Yeah. to check on the uh, skeleton then. He's guarding the exit, isn't he? I'm going to check on the skeleton and we'll do it with a miss. Seems to be a bit slow at responding. I've got a silver miss just in case. Get out of here. 
creatures are cool. Okay, that wasn't working. What's that? It's a switch. Okay, controls. Grab mode F2. that down there is a trap. The trap that's taken us completely in the wrong direction. Good to know. Sneaky. Good to know. Is it dust through these uh, dungeons back in the old days? They look better than this though. So Want to pull bats? Put one of them in. I didn't know that was the exit, I thought that was a, like some kind of tapestry. Started just scary that started dungeon. Sounds a shut up night. Well, I'm outside. Right. 
Okay. Don't know what happens so when we do when we arrive. Let's do it. Alright, we're in. Fourteen days there, I said it. Skill, I think. Skills. Ah, oh, fighting skill. Ah, oh, okay then. Get it map. Oh, there it is. That's a cool feature, isn't it? Actually, fast travel to the high school as well. Leave a mark, maybe. Hmm. By the way, the original Dungeon Keeper did this. Well, they did the other 2D picture and it always faced the player. It was kind of a fake 3D. Back when Dungeon Keeper first appeared. Ah! Seem to recall something about Big Tall Building being the fighter skill from many YouTube tutorials I've watched. So let's nip in here and have a look. There we go. Ah, right. I'm in the fighter skill now, so 
Yeah, now we've got the video. <laughs> Paris to be with it. <laughs> I love it. Uh, get a quest. Uh, unwanted house guest. Giant rodents. Giant killing. Runaway pet. I don't want to become uh, one of them yet. By every once in a while, we get an idiot that's let his client and says some fool left his door open and the wild animal got in. Um, it seems rather confused as to whether it's a bear or a tiger, but in either case, we want it wanted to eat him. Mm. Bears again. Yes, I'll take it. Guest on residence in old. I'm really bad at remembering that kind of things. Just in a farm will be outside, so it's. There's an exit. So let's um, let's go that way. Like the one. It's south. It's right around the outside of the town. people wandering the windows at night. Thank you. 
bad guy's coming to attack me. Look at that. The forests are full of people. Which is just strange. Very strange. Yeah, what should we do at night? We're going into the forest. That seems like a really good idea. Right. Okay. Where am I? Okay, it's just literally due south of me, so. Apparently, everything is procedurally generated except for a few key locations. So this bit of the game probably can get a bit semi. Remember playing Ishra back in the day. What the hell? I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to fall off the side of the planet. Yeah, I think I'm not to reload. Good job I saved, didn't it? Bethesda bugs. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, there was a rather good channel, I've got three and a half hour video explaining um, you know, Dragon, Dragonfall or Daggerfell and all the plots and stuff in it. I can't remember what it's called though. So. Well, Daggerfall units is a lot better than a DOS game, which is what it is. I'd much rather be playing on Unity than uh, as a DOS game. Yes, and the red bar stamina, health, stamina, magic. I'm glad they changed colours on that in later games.
Oh, it's a long walk. Old school RPGs used to be quite deep. There's a lot of stuff going on. Dialogue was a bit on the boring side. I think I've had to fast talk because I haven't been to it yet. Right, let's just save the game here. Let's do that one. Status L. But all was all right. Oh, I 
good. No idea how that happened. I'm guessing uh, one of the mouse buttons did it. Stone residence. Little easier to spell names than that. What the hell? How is that anywhere near the farm? That's mana. Tell me, left mouse button is pickpocketing. Yep, there we go again. Yeah. You know, without dialogue, 
What about uh there we go. Without dialogue and um, recordings, games are a lot smaller and technically can be a lot bigger. Right, um. right. Okay then, right. The let's go and get it over with. Readers. Oh, yeah. So I can't remember which was the right one. So I'm going to do that again, then. So. Just walk over there, yeah. My pickpocketing has improved. I wasn't even trying to improve the pickpocketing. Ooh. Well, we've done the first uh, mission, if it is a mission. Is that it? very fight girl, this isn't it? Hmm. 
Very friendly. I'm assuming that's magic. Right. Barber's shop. I'm clicking, but I'm not supposed to be. Right click. No. be successful I'm trying to talk I'm not trying to pickpocket I'm just trying to talk to the little kids Guess he didn't believe me that time. Right. I'm too sure what that symbol means there. But it's a nut. Oh, it's, it must be that thing I put on, um, that magical belt. That explains it. Okay, let's just explore a bit. Like this building here, it's obviously a different colour. General store. Right. 
think I'll sell that, keep that, sell that. That's quite a good weapon, isn't it? What's this one got? Okay, we've got other things in the shop up here, so we'll just go up here, found the other shop. Just to this. Back in the day, you said to spend a great deal of time trying to figure out the intentions of a developer in order to figure out the game they made. And by back where I started. You know. this building here, the green one. that one up
very helpful, aren't they? Right, okay. So there. Go around this back. A string of shops side by side. One, it's jewelers. Like the place. Right. Okay, then I'll right. sell that, sell that. Keep that, sell that, sell that, sell that. See these ones here that cause one damage, right? They're better because you're always going to get one damage. Ooh, that's a bit there. How can you tell if? Uh, Press it needs to actually be broken. We've got it from there. Right, These are all gills. Right, I think we'll uh, save it off there and call it a day. That was interesting. It does kind of grab you a little bit when you start playing. A bit confusing though, but back in the day when these first came out, and I am a gamer that started playing computer games in 1980, a lot of games were confusing. <laughs> you had to figure it out yourself. Right, we'll leave it there, and uh, depending on the comments, I'll either continue playing or I'll leave it. <laughs>